Hi guys, today I'm gonna tell you about four mini story and a little bit about a useful topic. The first mini story is called Green Tea. Green Tea, there is frog, she lives in Austin, Texas. The frog really loves green tea. Every day she drinks 85 cups of tea. Her favorite tea is green tea. One day she meets the bunny man. The man tells the frog, if you love green tea, you should go to the pan. The pan has the best green tea in the world. The frog is very excited. Unfortunately, she doesn't have any money. She needs money to buy a plane ticket to the bank. She wants to buy a Japan rail bus as well. So she goes to her mom. She asks her mother. Can you please give me four thousand dollars? I would want to go to Japan to drink green tea. Her mother says, "Are you crazy? I don't have four thousand dollars." The frog doesn't give up. She goes to her dad and says, "Dad, can you please give me four thousand dollars?" I really want to go to Japan to drink green tea. Her father says, I want to help you for sure, but I just don't have money. Why don't you go to the bank and get money? The frog runs to the bank. She goes inside and looks around. She sees the giant safe. In the back, she goes to the safe because she is more frog. No one sees her. She gets into the safe and takes seven thousand four hundred and sixty-two dollar. Then she leaves the bank. No one sees her. She buys a first-class ticket to the bank. And the Japan Rail Bus as well. When she arrives in Kyoto, Japan, she immediately goes to a tea shop. She buys 126 cups of green tea and drinks them all. She smiles and says, that's the best tea I have ever had. The second mini, the second mini story is called Baseball Pig. There is a little pig. The pig wants to be a baseball player. Every day he practices baseball. He practices hitting a baseball. He wants to be a big hitter. After 10 years of practice, the pig decides to try out for the New York Yankees, the most famous baseball team in America. He takes a direct flight to New York, then rents a car and drives to Yankee Stadium. He tries out for the Zenki, but the Zenkis reject him. The Zenki's manager says, I'm sorry, you are an amazing baseball player, but we can let the pig join our team. The pig is very unhappy. He goes to her he goes home and cries every day. <laughs> Finally his friend says to him, Come on, get a grip. Stop crying and try again with another team. 
The pig listens to his friend. He starts crying. He practices baseball every day. One day, he reading the newspaper, and he finds out that the San Francisco Giant needs new baseball player. The pig immediately flies to San Francisco. He tries out for the Giants. The Giants are very impressed with the pig. The manager says, "Wow, you are the best hitter I have ever seen." The Giants hire the pig and pay him two dollars. In his first game, the pig hits five home runs. Everyone in San Francisco loves the pig. The Giants give him a big raise. They pay him five hundred forty million dollars. The pig is rich, famous, and happy. The third mini story is called Fat Man. Fat Man. There is the Fat Man. The man is very fast. He weighs five hundred pounds, two hundred and twenty-seven kilos. When he walks, he always gets tired. The very fat man wants to lose weight. In fact, his doctor tells him, "You must lose weight or you will die." The fat man is scared. He doesn't want to die, so he starts the diet. For one month, he eats only grass. Of course. The grass tastes terrible, but the man really, really wants to lose weight. Unfortunately, after one month, he is still very fat. He doesn't lose any money. He doesn't lose any weight. Not one pound. The fat man is frustrated. He decides to exercise. Every day he walks twelve miles, twenty kilometers. Every day he is very tired. In fact, he he is exhausted. But after one month, the man is still very fat. Oh no! He is extremely frustrated. He decides to give up. He goes to her. He goes to a restaurant. She wa- He wants to eat everything because he is so frustrated. At the restaurant, he meets a beautiful woman. She likes him. He likes her. They begin to date. Every day, the woman cooks. Healthy food for the fat man. His new girlfriend makes the difference in his life. <coughs> the fat man lost weight after six year. After six months, he weighs only one hundred seventy pounds, seventy seven kilos. He thin. And he has a wonderful girlfriend. The man is true. The man and his girlfriend are both true. And the fourth mini story is called a kiss. A kiss. Cars by the new car is the very expensive car. It's a huge blue fast car. While driving down the street, cars see the girl on the bicycle. She has long blonde 
hair and is beautiful. He yells to her, "What's up?" She ignores him. He yells, "How's it going?" She keeps going and ignores him. He yells, "Hey, why won't you talk to me? I wanna go to dinner with you. I'll take you to an expensive restaurant." The girl turns, gets off the bike, and looks at him. She says, "I don't wanna go to dinner, but if you give me your car, I will give you a surprise." Carlos says, "Okay." He jumps out of the car. He gives her the keys and says, "Here are the keys." The beautiful blonde takes the keys. And then kiss Carlos on the cheek. Then she jumped into the car and drives away. Carlos then on sidewalk. Now he has no car and no girl. He says, "That's it. Just a kiss on the cheek." He gets on her bike and rides home. And useful topic is called how to speak perfect English. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Please don't think that learning English is too difficult. Everything can be mastered if you work hard and practice enough. You can speak wonderful English and have perfect pronunciation if you just remember. That learning a foreign language takes time. Try to find a friend so that you can study and practice it and practice together. Don't bother worrying about your mistakes. You stay with charming voices and pronunciation. Always follow along and repeat after the speaker on the stage. It's important to make English learning a part of your daily routine. You should take English as your food. Learn from every mistake that you make. Chinese needs. English talent. Vietnamese people who can enjoy losing face. I hope that you will use your English skills to do something truly outstanding in the future. If you set a clear goal for yourself and care deeply about your progress, you are sure to succeed.